Hello, I am Professor Alla Kalugina from St. Petersburg, Russia. My area of expertise is reproductive medicine and fertility preservation. These two areas of medical science have seen rapid development in terms of scientific research over the last few years. But now I'd like to focus on the practical uh, significance of it. Today I'd like to tell you about a high-priority area of assisted reproductive technology, which is the cryopreservation technique. The most exciting advancements uh, for Russian reproductive medicine have been breakthrough in fertility preservation technology and banking of biological material of patients. The recent success in vitrification has allowed us to implement several new clinical approaches, such as uh, banking of oocytes and embryos. Due to there being no difference between native and vitrified oocytes, it has become possible to create donor eggs bank. This is extremely convenient for patient, as there is no need now to synchronize donor-recipient cycles. And uh, there are no more waiting lists to depend on. Thanks to that, we can have a wide variety of donors with different backgrounds. Moreover, it is now possible to use banking program for various kind of patients. For example, uh, in cases poor response and uh, for patients with uh, several failed um, attempts of AIT and uh, for cancer patients before chemotherapy. Besides a high survival rate of oocytes and embryos, has enabled us to use freeze-all program for hyper-responsive patients. It is crucial for prevent of ovarian hyperstimulation syndrome. The past year has been very fruitful for us. The key event for us and for Russian reproductive medicine in general is, without a doubt, um, the first ongoing pregnancy following transplantation of cryopreserved ovarian tissue. These patients diagnosed with Hodgkin's lymphoma is um, at her 31st week now and we are looking forward to delivery this July. Even through there have been about 40 births to date. This will be the first such birth in Russia. We have gained a vast experience in this area and we would be happy to share it with you at our website. Thank you for your attention. Goodbye.